Today I'm going to show you how to create a basic curved ramp, uh, but instead of using the ramp tool, we're going to use a uh, inclined floor. So let's get started here with a uh, architectural wall or WA on your keyboard. You're going to stretch that out, and then we're going to escape out of that. Give it some kind of an arc, just something basic, nothing too special. Uh, that looks about good. I'm going to escape out of that and now we're going to go and create our floor architectural and then with the pick lines tool right here we're going to zoom in onto the face of the wall and select that. Now to create a floor you can't have just a single line you need to establish a boundary so we're going to offset it right here to five feet see the arrow right here we're going to offset uh, the other boundary by five feet so we're still in the pick lines tool and we're going to make sure we click on the correct side. So now you have your five foot wide ramp. Now to finish it off, you need to seal the boundaries. I hope make sure you take your offset off. Sorry. Zero. So you're still creating the floor, but this is eventually going to become a ramp. Uh, seal it off there. Press OK. And now go into camera mode. 3D will work fine. Okay, so you see the curve. Uh, you don't see much of a ramp yet because we haven't modified uh, the sub elements. What you do is you want to click on the ramp and then you're going to go up here to modify sub elements. This is what's going to let you change the height of your ramp. Right now it's at zero feet, zero inches at this point. So let's say we want four feet high at that point. That'll bring up that point four feet high. Ignore the thickness of the floor warning for now. Just click out of that. And then what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to the other point, modify sub elements, and then put in four feet as well. Now you see that you have a bit of a ramp. So here you're going to do the same thing. And then let's call this one eight feet. It's going to be twice as high as the other point and make sure you grab this one and you're going to grab that say eight feet as well hit escape a couple of times and there's your ramp uh, if you have any questions comments just let me know in the comments below i'd be happy to answer them for you thank you